this uniform. It's made out of copperhead hide. Uh, you know, these boots here, they're made out of honey badger skin. Honey badger's gonna win. <laughs> I'm a PT stud. I'm also the unit comedian. I like to tell my jokes behind people's back. Yes, I'm gonna force up my way through this whole competition. He got, yeah, he, he got pretty far in life. He won a medal of honor. Put a lot of money in an apple. I am Sergeant Lindsey Salazar, and I am with HHD, Joint Force Headquarters. I'm Specialist Gregory Wilson from 30th ABCT. I'm Specialist Jacob Lamb, and I'm from the 1454th Transportation Unit. My name is Private Collie. I'm Staff Sergeant Kibble. I'm from RRB, under 60th Troop. I'm Staff Sergeant Michael Bailey with Alpha Company FSC 505th Engineer Battalion. My name is Sergeant First Class Derek Morgan. I'm with the 139th Regiment out of Fort Bragg, North Carolina. My name is Sergeant Adam Hackett. I'm representing the 30th. I am uh, Roberto Stodomingo. I represent the 60th Troop Command as well as the 430th EOD. My name is Private First Class Kyle Smith. I'm from the 151 down in Lorenberg. Just because you're a female doesn't mean you can't go out and do what all the other guys are doing. Oh, I'm going to smoke the crap <laughs> out of them in swimming. I piss excellence. I can't help it. I'm going to win the best warrior competition because I've trained for it. I'm definitely motivated and I just want to make all my superiors proud and my family proud. I've got a little girl, she's nine. I told her I'd make her proud and she'd make me proud. I have a nine-year-old son, Dorian, who's very athletic and once he sees the different events that we've competed in and I won, he'll be super ecstatic. My motivation for being here is to prove to the Army that Type 1 diabetics can be an effective soldier. I'm hoping to motivate other people if they find out they have diabetes. I'm going to kill Land Nav. I am nervous, scared, excited. I can't wait. They're very proud. My dad was like, hua hua. I'm just going to think, keep driving. Pain's just a state of mind. It's temporary. At the end of the day, it's all worth it. My brother competed in the same competition last year. He got second place. I want to try and one-up him and win this thing and make him all proud. Win or lose. You know, you, you train to win, but you also train to fight and live another day. So that's what we're taking back. You know, I'm 41 years old. Looking at this obstacle course out here, I know it's a young man's game. Hey, anything you want to do, don't, don't let anybody tell you you can't do it. You're going to see a lot of competitors here who are hungry for something that a lot of people don't have the appetite for. To me, this is one of those points where the soldiers are starting to come together, really work together, regardless of it being a competition or not. When soldiers are under pressure, they automatically will bond. So it's one of those points right now where we're kind of in a low, but they're still in this bonding phase. The pain, there's, there's going to be pain in everything you do, but the, who you are as a person, you're defined as how you overcome that pain. Because I've got to fully perform. I cannot stop, I cannot waver. I've got to continue to excel in everything I do. I'm just going to take away the training and everything, uh, the good experience, the good friends I'm going to make. Just take everything, take it all in.
How you do? I have a strong belief that when you put soldiers under pressure, they will immediately build calm water. I just can't tell you. I mean, what this does for me personally, to have the chance to come out here and talk to these soldiers, it, it reinvigorates me. I've talked to a, to a few folks that are just very young, you know, one fellow I just talked to over there, hadn't even been in guard for a year yet. And then I go over and talk to another fellow who's 41 years old, and he says he's sore, but he ain't quitting either. So he's inspiring and he's leading them along the way. Anything you want to do, don't, don't let anybody tell you you can't do it. <laughs>